Okay, this morning is how to create a SQL statement to query the iPad's data in the Redshift Cloud. Uh, first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take a look at, I have Tableau here. And what I want to do is I already have a connection and I've already uh, submitted a SQL statement which created this table here locally. But I want to change that, I want to look at some different data. So I'm going to go down into Edit Connection, pull this over. There's a little bug in Tableau, and every time you do this, you have to select Public, because the schema isn't persistent between changing the connection details. And what I want to do is I want to get some more, a different SQL statement, so I'm going to go to my website. I'm going to click this button to get started. I'll go to finance. I'll go to, let's say, current funds expenditures by function. I'll select one of these. And we'll notice here that uh, even though these tables are, the system has decided that these tables have very similar structures. Uh, 1995, 1996, 97, etc. Uh, have exactly the same structures of the tables. These, these five. So I'm going to select these. Now, current funds expenditures and transfers for 1992 has 93% of the same fields as these tables up here. So I'm not really sure if that's the exact same according to the iPads folks, the exact same table. I'm just not sure. Uh, it has a different description, so I'm not going to select these. Notice it's already started. As I select the tables, uh, it already has the default unit ID and unit year, which will be in every table. So it's already started select, uh, creating the SQL statement just by selecting tables. In the middle here, we have the uh, fields that are similar to all to these five tables and I'm going to start selecting some fields and notice the SQL statement changes to reflect the fields I'm, I'm selecting so I'm happy with that go up here I'm going to select that SQL statement I'm going to right click and select copy I'm going to go back over to Tableau I'm going to select this, select all by right clicking, and then I'll right click again and I'll paste what I just copied from my website. And notice this is our, the old SQL statement we had ten, I had 10 minutes ago. I'm going to replace that now by clicking OK. And notice this has changed somewhat. <laughs> a lot of them have the same similar field names. And now I've I've submitted the SQL statement and now I can start placing fields on the on the uh, Tableau work area. And it's querying for the 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 years I selected and I'll select one of these fields and I'll place it over here just as a test. And there you go. This is where you guys come in, where you guys are good with this Tableau, Tableau application. And that's how easy it is to query iPads now from the uh, Redshift Cloud. Thanks.